guys, how are you? Welcome to my channel, welcome to Online Soccer Manager Best Tactics and today we have a really special video as you saw in the title. Today we will try to make a video for the beginners in Online Soccer Manager and also for no beginners in Online Soccer Manager and we will explain how it's working the game and exactly how to play Online Soccer Manager from zero. Let's go! Ok guys, before we start this video, don't forget to still support in the channel as you do. Don't forget to like this video, to subscribe and also to comment if you like this game or not. First of all guys, what is Online Soccer Manager? Of course, as you can see, it's an online game, but yes, it's a football manager simulator. Okay, I will explain you that in this game, uh, you have to pick a team, any team that you want. For example, you go to England, you can choose Manchester City, you can choose Manchester United, you can go to Spain, choose Real Madrid, I mean... They have all the leagues and also they have all the players, all the original players, so you will see right now how it's working. But yes, you have to try to win all the possible titles in just one season. You have the option to qualify for a kind of Champions League that is called Winners' Cup, but this is only at the end of the season. So yes, guys, I told you this game is only for one season. Try to do the best as you can with one team in one season. You can make transfers, you can make a lot of things that I will show you later, but I told you guys it's only for one season. After that, you have to pick up another team and start from zero again with another managers and other, uh, and other things. Okay, first thing in the menu, as you can see, we have the the leagues, the most popular leagues that we have, England, Champions, I mean this is the Champions League, uh, we got the Spanish League, Italian League, Germany League, uh, we have like a kind of Euro Cup from 2020, we have another kind of Champions League, uh, as well we have another leagues guys, like all the leagues, Albanian, Andorra, and I mean all these leagues that you have for example, as well you have Asian leagues, uh, you have American leagues, you have African leagues, you have special leagues that they are not like real, this one are not real at all. Uh, and also you have tournaments that you can play, like uh, tournament from Africa, Africa Champions, ASEAN Champions, I don't know, a lot of leagues and tournaments that you can play in this game. So it's a really, really good game that I recommend you 100%. This game, for example, you can play in your phone. I download the app uh, Online Soccer Manager or you can play in the PC, in the computer uh, you just have to go to the website onlinesoccermanager.com and that's it Ok, let's go to one league in this case, like uh, first of all you will choose one league in this case I have England look, all these teams that you see over here uh, are available to pick up. For example, Chelsea, I can sign the contract with Chelsea. They show me, for example, here all the players that has Chelsea at the moment with all the overalls, all these kind of things. And also, for example, if I want Liverpool, Manchester City, Manchester United, Arsenal in this case are not available because are already uh, taken by another manager. But if you wait a little bit of time, can be available. So it's not necessary that the first time that you are in the game to choose straight away one team that is available. For example, let's try another time. Maybe look, now I have Liverpool available, Tottenham, different things. I mean, let's try another time. Now I have Manchester United. It's the league is updating, so it's showing you different leagues and different uh, teams available. So in this case, for example, let's start with Manchester United. Okay, so as you can see over here, I told you that this is a manager simulator. So in this case, you can see that the next match we will have it in 13 hours. Uh, the thing is that you should know every game that you will play I mean, will be only one per day, only one every 24 hours. You don't have to play with your fingers, you don't have to do absolutely nothing. 
just choose a team make transfers this kind of thing choose tactics that i will show you now but for example it's not like fifa where you have to control your players or something like that or it's not like that guys it's just a simulator and it's really nice because every day we will have a match against another online manager so this is really cool for example you can see over here all the games that we will have uh, so for example if you are in this league you should know that you will play this league for 40 days guys 40 real days you will play this game so okay let's start with the things that you can do in online soccer manager let's go to the team we can see our squad our team like for example anthony rashford sancho we have all the midfields or the defenders all the players that you you have the things that you can do for example in uh, this game for example with your squad is to try to sell your players for example i don't want greenwood in my team i will add to him to transfer list so that's really nice you can choose a price and this kind of things and you will have to wait until one manager buys it or the proper machine is buying the the player another thing that you can do buy players that i will show you now in the transfer list and if you're asking me if you can loan one player to ask for example another manager uh, leave me one player or something like that ask manchester city for example can you leave me the brewing for two matches or or like half of the league no this is not working like that guys uh, you just only can sell players and buy players that's it more things that you can do in online soccer manager is choose your lineup uh, you have your team you have your team here and you have a lot a lot a lot of lineups here so if you want to play 43 you can do like that straight away i will choose anthony here i will choose rashford i will choose uh, martial for example but always guys i recommend you to put all the players in his right position as you can see right now more things that you can do in online soccer manager choose your tactics uh, yes you have to choose your tactics and uh, the way that your team is playing these things it's really difficult to explain you for a beginner how is working the tactics of course i will make a video explaining and these kind of things but you can find a lot of tactics in my channel more things that you can do in online soccer manager choose your specialist for example who is your captain who who will shoot the penalties uh, who will shoot the free kicks uh, who will take the corners you can choose all these kind of things more things that you can do i told you guys the transfer list this is the transfer list it's updating like every hour for example and you will see new players in the transfer list constantly so if you have the money you can buy them guys straight away if you sell players and you will make money you can buy sané you can buy griezmann you can buy angolo kante you can buy tony cross i mean every player that you like in the transfer list you can buy them the transfer list is constantly updating here you can see all the transfers that usually uh, they will do for example right now it's not any transfer but here in the transfer list is really nice more things that we have negotiation in case if one manager is asking you uh, to sell one player of your team so you can you can make a negotiation with the another manager of your league uh, more things that we will have trainings guys look i will explain you how it's working the trainings it's really easy if the training progression that is showing you is green is that the player for example i will put anthony right now to train but in uh, eight hours he will be 86 of overall so the overall as well it's growing up in this game so for example if i want sancho to train him he will be 84 instead of 83 so he will be a little bit much better so in this case i will choose anthony yes and you can see that every training is finished in in eight hours for example for the midfields as well i can choose one in this case i will choose mctominay for the defending as well i will choose lisandro martinez and for the goalkeepers you can see if it's in blue it's because the training progression is not yet completed so the hair even if i train him he will not upgrade to 85 but for example Dvraka, yes in this kind of training he will upgrade to 80 if i train him so in this case i will choose the hair so yes guys for the trainings you can uh, you can train every eight hours uh one attacking one midfield one defense and one goalkeeper that's it more things that you can do friendlies guys in this case yeah look for example you can play friendlies against other teams uh, in your league for example i will play one against arsenal i don't have my team done i don't have the tactics done so the result would be really random but you can see look we won one new in this case with the simulation martial score and that's it like precision guys that's it no, nothing special right now 
more things that we have secret training in case if you are playing against one uh, tough opponent so so you don't want him to see uh, your tactics your lineup that you will use for this game so it's like a secret training secret everything so he will not see nothing about you more things that we have training camp uh, the players they will go to a training camp uh, and you can see the you will have 25 percent more possibilities more chances to win the next game so that's really good but of course uh, you have only six training camps per season one of them costs 10 boss coins the another one 20 the another one 50 100 200 and 500 this is too much so i recommend maximum two per season and that's it in the matches you can see the league table you can see the match calendar you can see the cup because as well you will play cup you will not play any champions league it's not like that like for example manchester city you know that in reality it's classified uh it's playing champions league in this game no in this game it's just the league and the cup and after if you classify that I will explain how it's working uh, you can play one winners cup that's it press room conference every day you will see here like uh, conference like for example uh, Arsenal will have a new manager it's called like that uh, you will have you will see here a little bit the transfers like uh, a little bit of the press more things that you can do here stadium it's upgrade your stadium like capacity pitch training for example if you do the capacity it's all of them there are three levels if you do capacity uh, you will win more money every every time that you open the game so you will win more money but it's kind of things that I recommend because it's not too much money that work for you the pitch is really good decision to make it because uh, every time when you do a level you will have two percent more of home advantage when you will play or you can do the training and and the players they will have more progression than usual more things that we can see here club board that is not really i mean in the board you will see here the president they will uh, tell you how it's going the season if they are happy not and also if you are not happy in the league with your team uh, you can resign and that's it. It's not any problem. You can resign and choose a new team more things that you can do Let's see. I mean club. Yeah boss coins that you yeah the free boss coins I mean you can go there and watch ads and they will give you boss coins uh, More things that you can do is the stuff the stuff that you have the scoot in case if you want to find another player For example, you you are not seeing Mbappé in your league. You are not seeing Mbappé in the transfer list But for example, you are looking for Mbappé uh, you will choose like that position for example Mbappé is forward it's a striker quality of course Mbappé it's 85 to 99 age is young nationality you will choose here uh, French so for example it's French and where it's playing is playing as well in the French league so if you're doing like that it's coming back in 16 hours and you will see that Mbappé uh, I mean it's possible that you will find Mbappé with a scoot more things that you can do guys in the stuff yeah data analyst in case if you want to spy your opponent for example next uh, game i am playing against arsenal let's see who is playing you can see like that uh it's coming back in one hour but look if i pay two boss coins that i have right now the time is going back and look it's showing me like for example all the tactics that he has a little bit and also the lineup that is not complete because doesn't have any manager uh the doctor is really important for example you have uh injuries in your team and also guys the low year as well when you have a player with red card or something like that uh, that he will have like uh, six matches of suspensions three matches of suspension so you have to come here in the low year and maybe he can do I mean, he can help you a little bit and uh, make that this player to have only two matches of suspension or only one. More things that you can do is in the shop where you can buy boss coins with real money or you can watch ads for free and you can have uh, free boss coins every every ad that, we, that you watch. So this is really good. And also community, yeah, in case if you want to go to the forums or something like that, but that's it. It's, not, it's nothing special. So yes, guys, this is the basic of the game. Uh, I hope that you really like this video you really support this video i hope that i help you a little bit to understand uh, a little bit much better how it's working uh, online soccer manager and that's it guys don't forget to press a big like to subscribe and also to comment if you like online soccer manager or not ciao guys